Rapper Cardi B turned herself into the police Monday in New York, where she was arrested and charged with two misdemeanors in connection with a strip club fight in August. Police at the 109th Precinct in Queens charged the invasion of privacy rapper with assault and reckless endangerment, according to the New York Police Department. She received a desk appearance ticket, meaning she was released and will be ordered to appear before authorities at a later date. The charges stem from an August 29th incident at the Angels Strip Club in Queens. According to a night spokesman, Cardi B threw a chair that hit an unintended target. We are not aware of any evidence that she caused anybody any harm at the club that night, Cardi's lawyer, Jeff Kern, told reporters outside the station, NBC News reported. We expect that the matter is going to be resolved expeditiously. TMZ first reported on details around the brawl, which reportedly involved members of her entourage and centered on a long-running feud. Police told the Associated Press that bottles were also thrown and two bartenders were hit during the fight, which may have involved a romantic dispute. Lawyer Joe Ticopina, who said he represents the two bartenders, said in a statement that Cardi B ordered and committed violent assaults against my clients, and is being called to justice for her crimes. Apparently, she thinks her celebrity status puts her above the law. He added, but reality is setting in as Justice does not care whether her name is Cardi B or Carly B, and she will now answer for her crimes. Just over the weekend, Cardi gave her biggest solo performance since giving birth in July to a daughter she shares with her husband, the rapper Offset. She performed several hits on her latest album at the Global Citizen Festival on Saturday night in New York's Central Park. The festival which also included performances by John Legend and Janet Jackson, was interrupted when a concert goer stepped on a bottle, which caused it to pop. The loud noise prompted mass confusion and a brief evacuation. The Bronx rapper's career has been skyrocketing over the past year. Her debut studio album Invasion of Privacy immediately shot to number one on the Billboard 200 after it was released in April. Her pregnancy reveal during a Saturday Night Live performance became a must-watch moment. And she's a featured performer on the top Billboard song at the moment, Maroon 5's Girls Like You. She had originally planned to hit the road this fall with Bruno Mars, following their collaboration on Finesse, as part of his 24K Magic Tour, but dropped out several weeks after giving birth. I thought that after giving birth to my daughter that six weeks would be enough time for me to recover mentally and physically, she said at the time. I also thought that I'd be able to bring her with me on tour, but I think I underestimated this whole mommy thing. According to her social media accounts, Cardi is still busy working, though. And she's landed in headlines for other reasons, too. Last month. Photos and video emerged showing her and rapper Nicki Minaj getting into a fight at a New York Fashion Week party. Week party.